So what that was is an example of the 1-4-5 progression, in other words, a blues progression in the most rudimentary form, which you'll find a lot in Delta Blues. Uh, you don't hear a lot of turnarounds where, like, say, at the end of a blues progression, you go end up going back to the 5 chord and then back to the 1. Now, for those of you who don't know what a 1-4-5 progression is, uh, we're in the key of D. So what we're dealing with is D being your 1, and then you have... D, E, F, G being your 4, and then A being your 5. And so those are the three chords used in a 1, 4, 5 progression in the key of D. Um, so your 1 chord, there's different ways to represent, represent it on the slide guitar. And uh, one of them would be just the open... No, nothing on the guitar at all except for your picks, open strings. That's your one chord in the key of D. Another way to represent that is your 12th fret. So between the both of those you can break up your one chord and make it fairly interesting. To get to your four chord, your four chord is located right above your fifth fret. So what you want to see is your slide sitting exactly above it. And a, a lot of times it's easier if you slide just from like maybe one fret behind and listen to it approach that chord. So there's your four chord at the fifth fret. And uh, then after that, we've got your 5 chord, and that lives on the 7th fret. So let's go from the 6th to the 7th and just listen to that slide up. Now back to the 4 chord. And now the 1. So, in a typical progression, um, there's lots of different kinds of progressions. There's the 12 bar, 16 bar, and then there's like delta style stuff, which is more what we're focused on in this instructional video, which really kind of revolves around lyrics and sort of how the musician feels about whenever he wants to change. Um, that's why a lot of times it's hard to sit in with some of these old school guys, because they'll just change whenever they want to. Um, but that's sort of the beauty and the freedom of uh, Delta style slide blues guitar as well, is that you're really not conforming to anything else but your emotions, how you feel, and, and uh, where the lyrics take you. All right, so let's start with a uh, fairly simple uh, Delta blues progression here. We're going to do the one, four, five. Starting with one, going to four, we're going to go back to one, go to five, head on down to four, and then back to one. And then the whole thing can just start over and over again, go in an endless cycle until you decide to end it. And they always end on the one. So, starting with one. story, but that's going to be discussed in another chapter, so don't worry, we're going to get there. <laughs> 